Hi YouTube family, welcome back, welcome back. So today is the day. We are in Hollywood, Miami, Florida. It's like what, 30 minutes from each other? Anyways, today that is the day that I am going to get the corns removed from my toes. Now, if you know, then you know that I got one good foot, one ugly foot. I think I did go live when I got my foot tattoo. So my left foot is the sexy foot. It looks pretty decent. My right foot got these corns, right? And I went and got tattoos on top of them. And so like the little flower part, like, so the flowers on the top of the foot and then the, like the leaves go out. I'm gonna show y'all in a little bit. The leaves go out on the toes to try to cover up the corns. But anyways, the corn is a, a different skin texture. So the tattoo completely faded where the corns are. So then they, they started looking like berries. Like it was red at one point. So it started looking like berries. And I guess when I was on set and Nick Cannon looked down on my foot, he was like, what the fuck is wrong with your foot? And I was like, I got a tattoo, but it started fading. And he was like, you shouldn't have got it. I never noticed it before. So I started following um, this doctor, this uh, foot doctor on Instagram. That's who we're going to link up with today. He had done miracle, miracle, miracle. Dr. Wagner, he's done miracle, miracle on people's feet. Um, so we're going to meet him today. We're staying at this hotel. It's really nice. I'm going to show you guys the, the balcony and the view and stuff like that. But we got up to go get some Chick-fil-A breakfast. I got a biscuit. So I forgot some chicken bite minis. Why? That was weird. <laughs> <laughs> so this is our room. It's pretty spacious. But it's the view for me. It's like a... Is it a pond, lake? But look how shiny the water is. And then the pool right there. Nice little palm trees around it. They have a couple little pale palm trees, but everything is really nice. All right, well, I'm about to go wash my hair. This is my foot right here. So this is the good foot, showing y'all for free. This is the good foot. I don't like how that lady painted my toes. I was trying to fix it. I'm over here gluing on, gluing on my stones. She did a terrible job with my polish. But this is the corns right here. Them three in the middle. One, two, three. So you see how I made a leaf and it started fucking like peeling off? Anyways, so we're getting these cut today. I guess they're just going to pinch it, cut it off, and stitch it. Okay, the doctor is here. Superstar is here. So Let's tell you, go. Tell about your name, where you're located. Um, you know, which star do you Dr. Abraham it? Wagner, board certified cosmetic surgeon here in Hollywood, Florida. Of uh, just trying to make people feel better about their own selves. That's yes. what we do here. The the foot magician. We need to give you a name. The Picasso of podiatry. Picasso of podiatry. I like that one. That one's a good one. Okay, so I'm so excited. What are we doing to my toes today? Okay, guys. So, um, so y'all can see we have uno dos tres. Uh, absolutely. So so Mia reached out. You know, um, this is something that uh, is very commonly seen. Uh, unsightly lesions, unsightly corns, unsightly whatever it is. Obviously, uh, when we were talking in the past, you had notified me that I think that you tried, right? The good old tattoo method, yes. right? Uh, as everyone can see, um, the lesions are on the second, third, and the fourth toes here. And, and Mia tried to, to basically hide the unsightly. A lot of people use the good old tattoo method or even the... Cosmesis, right? The cosmetics. Yes. Right? Uh-huh. And use the corn stuff. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. The corn sealer, right? Yep. To kind corn of consume... sealer. Ha-ha-ha-ha. <laughs> yeah. uh, you like that, right? I like that one. <clears throat> so um, a lot of people do the makeup trick. Um, also, um, it's unsustainable. That's what I like to call it, right? People just continue to do it, do it, do it. Um, you know, uh, a lot of people use the over-the-counter remedies. That's something that we that we mm -hmm. talk a lot about. Mm -hmm. The over-the-counter remedies. Uh, my recommendation is not to use them. Yeah. Right? They're very they're very caustic. Okay. It's it's a chemical. It's an acid. It burns the skin. Uh. Okay. And depending on the skin type, mm -hmm. right? The the symptoms may be different. Right. Yeah. The darker skin types, the skin may become hypopigmented. Right. Uh, and vice versa, right? So um, it's really, really important to educate the the world uh, what to do, what not to do. That's one of the things of what not to do. Oh, stretch it. He's he has beautiful toes. How he talks. He talks how, about it all the time. Yeah, but how would you know? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> he tried to get me to suck them, but I'm like, I don't know. Get maybe five margaritas. <laughs> There's always truth to every joke. <laughs> That's why. Why are you blushing, man? I like showing my feet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. Show your feet. Show your feet. Show your feet. Yeah, yeah, show your feet. Show the foot, Picasso, your feet. Yeah, and I'll show mine. Okay, okay. Oh my god. Okay, so this is the time where we gotta open up our only for fans. For free? Page. Only fans, right? We're like we for free. There it Whoa. Is. There it is. Right? Wow. Mm -hmm. What do you think, Doc? Mm -hmm. Do you think his feet are hot? Oh, that's awesome. <laughs> you think that's a hot Sorry. feet? Hold on, I gotta get this. Action. Action. <laughs> well, we're back. Uh, so basically, you know, what what um, what I recommended is essentially, you know, uh, just the removal excision of the unsightly lesions. The skin. Uh, yep, absolutely. Yep. Um, just like that. We plucked them out. Uh, everything's done here. Office-based surgical suite under local anesthesia. Yeah, you're awake. Yes. You walk in, walk out. We'll be flying out when? Sunday. Sunday. So yeah. you guys are going to enjoy some uh, some hot weather here. Warm yep. weather, just like in Cali. And then, um, and that's about it. Uh, of, of relevance, if, if there's an underlying structural problem, Mm -hmm. Right, we talk about hammer toes in this particular case. Mm -hmm. I always recommend to um, you know address those underlying structural abnormalities, uh, also to obviously you know uh, minimize the reoccurrence of the lesion. I don't think it's too bad because I've seen toes like this. Exactly, that's kind of so. like the yeah, yeah. They're throwing up like signs and whatnot, yes. right? Yes, gang sign. So, uh, but yeah, I mean, uh, this is called the non-weight bearing, right? You're sitting, you're not standing. So uh, people may think that, oh my God, look at her toes are kind of like that, like claw toes, but that's not necessarily the case, right? So what we're proposing today is obviously just the excision of these unsightly lesions. Um, Cosmetic. Absolutely, you know, co uh, Dr. Wagner, is, is cosmetic foot surgery a thing? Very much, mm -hmm. right? Uh, there's no question that a lot of people are seeking, whether it's um, toe lengthening, toe shortening, making their feet smaller, slimmer, thinner. Oh, y'all gotta see his work. I gotta <laughs> post it, I gotta link it in here so they can see it. Amazing, how do you make that big, big toe shrink like that? The a people with ball, the long toe. Oh, the long toes, yeah. All, all of our procedures, uh, just to be very clear with the public, all of our procedures are done here in our office-based surgical suite, local anesthesia. Uh, you're, you know, the patient is awake, patient walks in, walks out. We do not use any internal fixation. No pins, screws, or plates at mm. all. Uh, I think that um, if, if for all the people out there that are curious to see what we do, um, I would just send them to the Instagram. The Instagram, Instagram. yeah. Instagram. That's, that's the, that's the you, ticket there. You're really good, and you're a good talker. I like that. Not bad for my first time. At all. You're professional. All right, so this is Dr. Wagner's page, you guys. Jaws Podiatry. Am I saying it right? Yep. Absolutely. You know, like, I... I don't be pronouncing stuff right. <laughs> so let me show you this video that I'm referring to. Okay, so this was the toe that was long. You see how long this toe is? That's super long. And wow, look at that. That is perfect. I can't believe that's a before and after. Wow, amazing. And then this one is a claw tall. Claw tall. Claw. A claw. Lobster, lobster claw. Lobster claw toe. Yep. Look at that. And... Boom, that's the after. Look at it was like that. It was like a fucking lobster. Amazing. Amazing. Um, yeah, so follow him on Instagram. And um, yeah, does really good work. So if you thought there was no hope for your ugly ass feet, there is hope. <laughs> uh, so Mia, what we're going to essentially do here is we're just going to excise everything you can see there. We're going to excise these tiny little lesions, right? And believe it or not, what's interesting, sometimes when we do this... I fix the tattoo. Some, some, somehow everything comes together. Really yeah. Nicely. Let's see what happens right after. It's not something that we try, but you'll be surprised. Um, but yeah, I mean, did you use any over-the-counter remedies at one point? Yes. Yes. Yes, the corn so, stuff. Yes, exactly. Mm -hmm. The corn stuff. Yeah. So the corn stuff is what, in your particular case... It's peeling. Uh, it's dry. It's a burn. Yeah. So you see how it's kind of like a little bit rough and tough? Mm -hmm. That's what we mean, right? Um but Dr. Wagner, why are those remedies out there? I don't know. Because it right? sells. Absolutely. You yeah, said it. Because it sells. <laughs> right? Tatin. Uh, but, um, you know, we try our best to tell everyone, you know, be very careful out there. Uh, before you do that, my recommendation is uh, maybe change the shoes. Be a little bit more mindful, not just to grab that and go. Yeah. Right? yeah. So, mm -hmm. Well, good. I really got it because when I was younger, you know, I was squeezing my feet into shoes because a size three and a half was like about $30 cheaper. 
then go into a four. And that we hear a lot of. People mm -hmm. come in here and they say, you know, Doc, you know, when I was growing up, we didn't have the resources available, right? My my parents were, were you know, uh, using, uh, you know, they used to put me in these very, very small shoes. My toes used to go like this yeah. and I had the long toes yeah. and all of a sudden they have these unsightly yeah. lesions that with time just got worse mm -hmm. and worse. And then you get older and you wear heels. So boom, boom, boom. Right. It's kind of like that that hamster wheel. Just kind of like... Mm -hmm. right? We should call this the toe tummy tuck. Yeah. The, well, there the, is such... A, so, you know, I, I don't know if you've seen it on our page. We talk about the toe tuck, right? The toe tuck. <laughs> what, what yeah. The, what the heck is that, Dr. Wagner? <laughs> Basically, a lot of people come here. They're not happy with the appearance of their toes. Why? Because they're a little bit chubby. Something that we call... Toby B.O. Tobesity. Toby, Toby Tobesity. <laughs> oh, fat toes. That's right. Tobesity. You like that one? You like that one? <laughs> so, Tobesity is a thing. A lot of people are not happy with the appearance of their toes. They're chubby, right? They look like little like little sausages, little yeah. papayas, right? So, what we basically do is a uh, tummy tuck for the toe, also known as... Mm. Toby. Toe, toe, toe tuck. Toe tuck. Toe tuck. Right. Tobesity is the disease. It's a condition. Yeah, condition. <laughs> and then the toe, toe tuck. Yep, the mm -hmm. toe tuck. Lipo for the toe. Uh, tummy tuck for the toe. Yeah, tummy tuck. Nip and tuck. Nip and tuck. Suck, nip, tuck. Yep, whatever, whatever, whatever you want to do. I'm super um, excited. And again, uh, the procedure, no more than probably half an hour. Okay. Okay. Um, and that's essentially what we're going to do. So without further ado, let's get to work. Let's get to work. I'm super excited. I've been waiting for this moment for a really long time. My toes have been looking like this for a long time. I've been covering it, okay? But I, I, like I was talking with Dr. Wagner, when my boss was like, what is that on your toes? That's when I was like, oh, yeah. Because once it started fading, it's I promise, like berries. I, I, I don't have a foot fetish, guys. I, I don't have a foot fetish. <laughs> <laughs> it's my job. It's my career. Oh, my God. Stretch doesn't either, look. <laughs> <laughs> Very, very mild, right? Very mild hammer toes. Mild. So, um, if she if, does that a lot, like she, she only buckles, <laughs> yeah, yeah, a lot of people do that, right? Um, and that's just who she is, right? Uh, the toes buckle like that, uh, has to do also with the I assume that you wear a lot of high heels, mm -hmm. right? So, a lot of people that wear high heels do that, you know, that that buckling as well. Uh, but again, you know, can I easily say, hey, Mia, we got to fix number two, number three, number four, like stretch them, uh, and fix the structural deformity. Uh, we can, but, you know, bearing in mind other variables that, uh, you know, more than anything that Mia is all obviously very, very busy in what she does. Yeah. That's something that... Uh, Way more healing time. Uh, more well, downtown. The, the, the honest truth is there's never a great time for elective foot surgery. Right. Fact. We don't walk on our face. We walk on our feet. Right. Uh, You've got to get around. So the recovery for only the, the, the corner removal is very 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 well easy mm -hmm. smooth sailing okay um which is basically dr wagner what, what what does that entail well basically we're you know as everyone will see in the after we'll have maybe two three little stitches here here uh here and uh, basically the efforts go into what i like to call scar management scar management very very important okay it's not about anything else good patient good outcome bad patient bad outcome that's right take care of your healing process and your investment Yes. Okay. I had a lot of surgery, so I should know about that. <laughs> Ew. <laughs> no, you haven't. You told me you haven't. <laughs> you can't tell. You said natural over here. Of course. <laughs> Everyone is all natural. <laughs> can't you tell? <laughs> are we working or are we just having fun? <laughs> okay, anyways. Um... So yeah, so uh, but Dr. Weiner, what about this this mild bunion that Mia has, right? So yeah, uh, you know the bunion very commonly seen again in, in oh in, this thing is a bunion yeah that little whatever you want to call it yeah the bump right, mm -hmm. uh, but uh, you know that's something that uh, in your particular case very very mild obviously if it ain't broke you don't fix yeah, it yeah that doesn't uh, bother me right so uh, again our efforts today mm -hmm. removal of ugly corns done boom 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 let's get started let's do it. And action. Okay, here we go. <laughs> so, um, what we're going to be doing now, again, um, just putting the, the little toes to sleep, and we use a little bit of local anesthesia, okay? We use a little bit of cold spray, just for, um, so the individual doesn't actually feel the needle. The what? The needle. Okay, so here we go. And then we do a little poke like this. One, two, three, boom. There it is, a little pinch. How does it feel? Tell everyone out there. That wasn't bad. All right, any pain? No. Right. So for everyone out there, how is there no pain? Um, we use a solution, okay, um, in the anesthesia to neutralize the what? 
I can't talk. Uh, <laughs> You're asking me questions. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> the, the burning. The burning. Okay. So for all the people out there wondering, you tell them, did you feel anything? No, that wasn't bad at all. Okay. And you guys know my pain tolerance is shit. Cold spray again and a little pinch. There it is. And then we put a little bit there. On a scale of 1 to 10, 10 being the worst pain, tell everyone out there. We're about a 4. Okay. Not bad. Oh, there it is. Okay. Ta-da! Like, I feel the cold air. You feel? Yeah, with a dark eye. Then that's the number. Uh, yes. And okay, then cool. uh, one last one, just right here. And after that, that's it. Okay. That's probably the worst part of this entire process. Okay. You know, people are always saying, oh my God, the needle, the needle, the needle, the local anesthesia. I hate needles. Everyone hates needles, right? Uh -huh. But we, we really try to minimize that burning, right? Using a little something, something, right? There it goes. A little pinch. There it is. Did you feel that? No. Right. It's probably... I feel the cold more than the needle. Right, exactly. Oh, it was the whole needle. I didn't know it was no, the whole no, needle. No, 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 no. <laughs> I can see that far. So that's it. So now um, we'll uh, you know we'll let the anesthesia marinate a little bit. Okay. Okay. The toes are going to start to feel a little bit what? Funny. Okay. Nummy. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Now we are drawing on the toes. We're going to draw a little bit here. That's what we're going to cut off. Yep. You cut in a circle or do you cut in a line? <clears throat> There's some uh, trade secrets. Mm -hmm. Oh, the secret? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Not telling you. We do. Um, we, we really have developed some some really nice techniques. Yeah, you did the job. I think so. Not bad for my first time today, I think. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I play too much. So it's actually an elliptical incision. All right, now we are washing my feet. Well, I died, right? I died. Yep. Barbecue. Barbecue sauce. Barbecue stuff. Ooh. Okay, guys. So for today's procedure, um, this is a very, very special procedure because we're going to be using. Mimi's, what, what do you call it? Lovely chop chop Lovely knife. Lovely chop 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 chop. We're gonna use a chop chop knife to chop chop the corn. That's right, that's right. No, uh, yeah, this, we're uh, not, yeah, for guys. All the people out there, uh, you guys have to obviously buy, purchase, right? Yes. The chop chop. Sixty dollar. Yeah. Okay, right. Sixty sixty dollar. Yeah, pretty reasonable, right? What else do you want me to say? That's it. You're good. Let's go. you Howdy guys up and cooking, You guys like you know doing a uh, thing in the kitchen. You guys have to buy the top top. Yes. By lovely Mimi. Yes, sell that. Yeah, I mean, sell the I mean, shit. Look at this. Look at this package. Who is that beautiful lady in the front of the package? My gosh, that like smile. Me. It looks like me. Okay, guys, let's, uh, all jokes aside, let's get to work. All right, let's get to work. Now I gotta put the balls in there. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Now you have to do what? Now I gotta tuck the balls in there. <laughs> Who is it? Oh, yeah. I think I dropped my bag. It's okay, you can leave it. Wow, they're wrapping me up, guys. It's getting serious. Whoa. Okay. Keep your hands inside. Oh, there you go. Super. Oops, the anesthesia. Okay. Peekaboo. Peekaboo. Okay, so uh, first thing you do, you test the anesthesia. Okay, just to make sure that everything is nice and numb. Okay, so that's essentially what we're doing here. I always ask patients, do you, do you feel anything? Um, I didn't feel that one. This one? No. No, it's, it's not, it's not like, no, it's like a little tickle. Okay. But not so, really. I think we're good. Of course, um, we're going to go ahead and also use a little tourniquet. Okay. Right? Uh, which basically stops the bleeding for something like this so we can actually see what we're doing okay okay so uh we'll go ahead and put a stop to this and uh, as soon as we're done we'll do uh the grand reveal okay sounds good why he All ripped right. off the curtain and showed me this <laughs> it's so funny oh, all dear. done that was fast you guys that was like what 10 minutes i don't know i don't know it might be 10 minutes it was fast it's all good. Um, 
So again, uh, we're here in our office based surgical suite, local anesthesia, Mia, uh, or Mimi. Mimi. Is, I think, wide awake. Yes, I am. She was trying to, we interrupted her, her beauty sleep. Um, so what we, what we proposed here was, um, again, the excision, right? unsightly lesions, two, three, and four, okay? Um, again, for a lot of people out there that might see this, they may say, oh, but you didn't really have anything. Oh my God, right? But this is really personal. This it's is personal, about, right? yes. This is about you, mm -hmm. right? Feeling better about yourself, yes. right? Every time that you use open toes, you know, shoe sandals, sandals yeah. that, that you don't feel a certain way, mm -hmm. okay? About the appearance of your feet. So, um, without further ado, let's take a look, okay? Wow. Okay, so what do we have here, ladies and gentlemen? Let's just go like that, okay? So what we see here is on each little, there's a little incision, right? Uh, three tiny little stitches on each little incision. Um, and, and as everyone can, I don't know if you guys can see this, but I tried my best. Sometimes we can actually... Yeah, you connected the you leaves. Can, uh, <laughs> you connected the tattoos. Right, and, and what we're talking about is, is it's this right here, you see? Uh -huh. We connected this with this. Now it's connected here and, and, and it's connected here and there. It happens a lot. It's kind of funny. Look at this one. Like, wow. for example, from here to here, yeah. we brought it from here to here. So it kind of looks a little bit less patchy. Yeah. It's not something I planned. Yeah, right? wow. Um, and the same thing here, right? Obviously, there was not really, there, there was nothing, no ink on the other side here. But um, for all the people wondering, hey, Doc, so what happens now? So um, Mia's going to be here today walking with the Gucci it's somewhere around here. Oh, let me go get the Gucci. <laughs> People always want to see the Gucci, right? It's important, right? So here we go. Right. Wow, it's beautiful. <clears throat> Woo! Okay. Sell it as much as knives. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I got to get on QVC next. Uh, anyways, so uh, the Gucci, and we're going to be using the Gucci for a couple weeks, right? But Dr. Wagner, why not just go into a sandal? Um, because that's not the protocol, right? We use the ugly shoe. Uh, nothing will irritate, put pressure on the incision sites. I was just telling Mimi that 95% of what we do uh, in, uh, in all of this corn removal is what? Good patient, good outcome. Good, yep, right? good patient, good outcome. I told you stop asking me questions. <laughs> I'd be so lost. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I didn't do good in school. <laughs> Neither did I. Right? So, 95% um, of corn removal is really... Um, scar management, right? Yeah. Taking care of the areas while they heal first two, three weeks, really, really important. At two weeks, the little stitches are gonna be removed, two weeks. Mm -hmm. And uh, Mimi's gonna go back to uh, Cali yes. and the stitches will be removed over there. Everything is done virtually at that point. Yes. So, Dr. Wagner, what happens after the stitches are removed? Uh, then we will continue to focus our efforts on scar management, yes. making sure that everything heals. I, you know, Mimi, you cannot go to the beach. Okay. Okay, very, very important. Uh, very important to keep everything clean, covered, and dry, just to follow all the recommendations that we make. I can shower? Um, you Please. can shower for two months. <laughs> two, oh my God. <laughs> uh, yes, absolutely. We I do provide shower. the shower caps. Okay. Right? So you can actually take a, a, a shower. A full shower, okay. Absolutely. Okay, so okay. just wrap it up while I'm showering. Yes, absolutely. So uh, again, um, you know, uh, just Mimi said before, it took about 10, 15 minutes and um, she walked in, we'll be walking out. They're gonna, I think they're gonna yeah, go enjoy Yeah, I think they look better already. Absolutely. I love it, thank yeah. you. So, and if anyone is wondering. Is that the corn, is that the corn? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's see them. Watch out, watch out, they're here, they're here. There's ah! one there, right? So congratulations, <laughs> it's a baby yes! boy, you got triplets. They look like little, like little what? boogers, <laughs> little boogers, <laughs> big boogers. <laughs> Achoo, right? um, so congratulations. Thank you. It's a, it's a baby boy. Thank you. Thank and a baby you. girl and a baby girl. Kind of like that. Okay. He's wrapping me up. Yeah. And then I like to always, unless you want me to leave it like that, we can cover the toes. Yeah, you can cover it. Okay. So then we go like this. So I can feel like a sock. Yep. And then we apply this here. Got my shoe. Thank you so much, doctor. You did such an amazing job. You have such a great personality. Um, I really enjoyed my visit, and I think the outcome was so fast and so beautiful, and your staff and your wife is amazing, so thank you. So, yeah, if you guys have ugly feet or need anything done to your feet, he's located here in Hollywood, Florida. Amazing job. I had a great experience. Thank you. What Thank you for choosing say. us and, of course, trusting us. Yes, you did such an amazing job. I'm so excited, y'all. Ah, my 
corns are gone. Okay, I'm gonna tag everything. He actually has a very big YouTube channel too. So I'm gonna tag him and link him on uh, all of the description below. So make sure you guys check him out and follow him on Instagram and TikTok. Amazing work. And thank you guys for watching. Say bye, Doc. Bye. bye